Dragon Quest, an elusive age. Dragon Quest The Luminary Dragon Quest XI, your main character is here. What is a prequel? No, no. This is the definition of a prequel. Um, Dragon Quest Eleven. You made your What is the main character's name in Dragon Quest? Oh wait, these are all in caps. Oh no, I don't want all cap. No! This character's not supposed to be cap. No! Alright, I'm done making that stupid joke. Um The reason why I'm playing this, I'm in kind of a gaming slump. Last game I played was two days. And I need to get back into that thing. I used to play games just for the fun of it. So, Dragon Quest XI was one of the games I bought, and it was just for the fun. Now, So you could either play this in 3D mode, which we are going to play in for the main story. We're going to play this later because there's a lot to do in 3D mode than in 2D mode. So let's play. We will do 2D mode. I don't know if it's going to be in this live stream. Something in the main town. So this is the dark insects left over from the evil that we find out. But I'm just explaining it as it is. This is a prequel to the first Dragon Quest game. So this takes before every other time. So you have to play the Dragon Quest game backwards or 
the surfboard is I don't understand. But you can pretty much um, jump in and climb the fantasy any point. Because you don't need to understand why four dudes are in the car driving around the goddamn maybe. So you can just play like uh, Final Fantasy in any fucking order. Does not because they're always fighting over magical rocks. He is the they're one. doing some kind of stupid the mark. Dragon Quest is like, let's bounce There's the no game around in different orders. And it's like, uh, yeah, that's not fun for anyone. Can you just put them all in order through each game? And they're like, no, let's put Dragon Quest 11, then 1, and then we're gonna put 3 or 2 or whatever next and it's like I mean look what do you, well, I'm looking at something now because this doesn't make any sense. What Dragon Quest game do you play first? How, how do you play Dragon Quest in the world? Play 11, then you play 3, then you play 1, and then you play 2. Did that make any sense to you? No? Good, because it didn't make any sense to me either. You're supposed to play 11 first, the, the last game in the series first. Then you're supposed to play 3, then you're supposed to play 1, and you're supposed to play two to understand the effing timeline. The hell? Who came up with this? Yes, I am going to top over. This is a fucking button. All right, man. I'm not getting copyrighted. I'm not getting your life. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking at this in actual game mode. What are you doing here? What the hell is up with this? I'm an awful storm, too. This is, I'm playing with them in whatever order. You, you guys figure out what time when they play for. I'm doing it. Yes. What's this? You better stand on your own. Oh, you I'm not standing thing. up for you. Let's look at this guy. This guy looks like a Dragon Ball Z character. There's no the hell? need to be frightened anymore. You're safe now, little fellow. Alright, hopefully we can play the game now. After all these cutscenes and after all that BS. Yeah, because I'm looking at the actual game order and it doesn't make any damn sense. And then there's like Japanese exclusive games, which I don't even understand. Like, I, I'm already getting a headache, dude. I haven't even played the game yet. And, uh, and, and I'm already confused. You got me looking confused over here. So much, you're a lifesaver. Trust me to lose my headscarf just before the big ceremony. <sighs> so it's finally here, the big day. I can't believe we're going to be climbing all the way up there. Yeah, Dragon Quest is like one of those old RPGs. They stick to their roots and like, um, meaning gentle. You're looking for more experience. <laughs> Looks like Sandy's keen to lead the way. RPGs and Final Fantasy. Come on, best not keep her waiting. <laughs> I mean, like, oh, damn, dumb legs! Dumb legs! Anyways, yeah. There's no new game plus or anything, but. Okay, 
Okay, so you're just gonna tell me how to play the game. Folk of Cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. That's how it goes, isn't it? Oh, wait, I don't remember My that granddad's been dragon teaching dragon me the prayer ever anymore. since I was little. He reckons the spirit of the land really does live on Cobblestone Tour, you fantasy. see. As long as I can remember, he's been preparing me for this day. The day it would finally be my turn to climb all the way up there and offer my thanks. I just wonder whose idea it was in the first place, sending the village's young folk on such a dangerous errand. What if I take a tumble and do myself a mischief? No. Well, not Back to worry. Thank God. Since you and me were born on the same day, I'm lucky enough to have a bodyguard along for the journey. Come on then. That craggy old thing won't climb its... Oh! Oh no, Bob! So dangerous, ah. ah! Monsters! They're coming this way! They're so dangerous. Look at them. They're bouncing. Watch out! I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I know they were only little, but I'd have been done for if you and Sandy hadn't been here to help me. Sandy Cheeks! Your dog and needs to stop walking around. And now we've got to go through that horrible, <laughs> dingy cave. Just our luck. <laughs> I'll bet you anything space. that's Don't where those awful that things up. came from. If you look up, well, I'm going to be as long in as you're with me, I've got nothing to worry going about. To be in trouble. Come we're on, going let's get going. Trouble. Don't you dare look that up. You know, Minecraft is like the only game, and I know this doesn't matter, but Minecraft is the only game that. Uh, The only game where, where you can play in the dirt and you won't get a disease. Yes! Auto save! Thank you, Lord! Because some games don't have bugs. I think it's very sweet. Oh, I, oh, that's weird. I had a cough there for a minute. Uh, how how that's great. Um, it's all mapping up here. Yes, I will get every single item. Plus, I will get all the trophies for this one. Don't you worry, there's a full trophy list. Shut up. Can do 
왜? 
uh, depends on Help! your active gear. Help me! Cole? Never run into this oh, kid again. Quick! You have to help well, him! Seriously, why was he here? <laughs> the winds of change! It's not fog at all! It's more monsters! Technically you're not the hero, and technically we are right. Each tragedy always keeps the fog. I don't know how we're beating up Watch against. Out. I don't know how we're beating up against. Crikey! I guess since we're the illuminators, we don't have to explain anything. And since we also know a lot about it, we can use the fireball. I guess. <laughs> And fight some more! Get him! <laughs> well done! I like how he gave me the thumbs up. Dumb lad! I'm sorry, Gemma. I only came up here because I thought it'd be funny to jump out and surprise you. But then those monsters appeared. Here. Long eyebrow. What in the world is going on? I never heard anything about monsters appearing on the tour before. But never mind that now. Whatever did, were you why thinking? Why did you bring a you why did he bring killed. a sword? You take Sandy why and get back I to the village this instant. Yeah, yes, Gemma. Sorry, Gemma. This is <sighs> You saved my bacon again. <laughs> I knew you were tough, but crikey, you too. really have grown into quite the hero. <laughs> Alright, stop. <laughs> I'm Not far to the top now. <laughs> Alright, man, I'm, I'm serious. I have to stop, man. I have to stop. I mean, it's already, Typical. The comment section it would have to go and start cool. raining, wouldn't it? I'm dying. Come on, let's get a move on. I have way too much I don't know if it's like playing a good game or it's just like a game swap. Anyways, um, Ray Wayne, go away. Come back. Never. People say. <laughs> Back and never. They come back and never. You, you, you need water. Make sure you're drinking four bottles of water a day, or your kidneys will fail. Your kidneys will absolutely fail. And then you gotta be on the house. That's not good for you or anybody else. Here we are at last. Oh. It's such a shame about the weather. I was really looking forward to that view. Well, we better say the pair and get this ceremony over with, eh? What, what was that? Um, it's called, let's get the hell out of here, never mind. Ah! Oh look, it's a bald eagle. Ah! Hey friend, ah! not friend, ah! not friend at all. Help, help me, help. Oh, oh, save help! me. There's the guy running here. I 
turn him into some fried turkey chicken. We're alive. But how? We're alive. That, that great big flash of lightning. It was almost like you made it happen. We can worry about that later. All I know is that you saved me yet again. I don't know what I'd do without you. You can kiss me. <laughs> we really had. Ah, she's resting. Humble folk of cobblestone, great yeah, land spirits, hearth well, and you home. can always watch something else. Lift your voices up in prayer. Sing it across all our drear. Blessed are we since days of yore. Let it be so forevermore. <gasps> wow! Look! Just goes on and on and on. Whoever dreamed up this ceremony must have had this in mind. They wanted to show us how huge our world really is. <laughs> well, that's it. It's all over and now we're grown ups. Should we head down and tell Grandad and everyone? What the heck? That's how you become They'll an adult. They'll all be waiting oh, for us at the bottom. Climbing up a cliff? See, all we have to do is just drink. Be old enough to drink or old enough to know to be able to be able to be an adult. Like, we don't need to die. Like, that was back in the old days. Like, we needed to die or be beaten near death. <laughs> Indeed you are, my dear. Thank the spirits for that. When we saw lightning striking up there, we got a little worried, I have to tell you. <laughs> well, I never. Sounds like it's nothing short of a miracle that you made it back in one piece. Well, there's no doubt about it, the spirit of the land was watching over you. Now tell me, my dear, how was the view from the top? Oh, it was wonderful. I saw the sea stretch into the horizon and the sunlight playing on the water and... Oh, I've never seen anything like it in my life. <laughs> You're true cobblestonians now. 
Only we have the pleasure of looking out over the world of Erdria in such breathtaking fashion, you know. I are still young, and the day may yet come when you decide to leave Cobblestone behind. I hope our little ceremony has opened your eyes to a little of what may await you out there. <laughs> now, it's high time we were heading back. I'm sure your mother is eager to hear how things went, young man. Don't keep poor Amber in suspense. <laughs> Come on, you. Home time. Soldier. Well, not so little anymore. I've heard all about your big adventure. Look at you, all grown up. I hope he wasn't too much of a bother, Gemma dear. <laughs> of course not. Quite the opposite, in fact. You would have been proud of him. We got attacked by a monster at the top of the tour, and I ended up hanging onto the edge of the cliff by my fingertips. I thought I was done for. But you'll never guess what happened next. That mark on his hand suddenly lit up, and a bolt of lightning hit the monster. What did you say? That funny little mark? Lightning flying about the place? Goodness me. Here I was hoping he'd turn out nice and ordinary, but it seems his grandfather was right all along. Well, I've been putting this off for long enough now. You and me need to have a little talk. Here, this belongs to you. Your grandfather asked me to give you it once you'd come of age and climbed the tour. The truth is, there's something I've been keeping a secret all these years. Something I've never told another soul in the village. It's... how can I put this now? Um... well... he said you're... You're the reincarnation of the Luminary! What? Oh, don't ask me what the old fool meant, dear. I haven't got the foggiest. All I know is that your grandfather said you had a special destiny and that there was something you had to do. He said that when you came of age, you were to head north to the capital, up there in Heliodor, and show that necklace thingy to the king. 
He seemed to think that if you did that, all would become clear. Clear as mud, I shouldn't wonder. Anyway, the long and short of it is that if you want to find out what this is all about, you'll have to leave Cobblestone and head over to Heliodor. Crikey. <laughs> well, I can't stop you leaving, I'm sure, but you won't be marching on an empty stomach. Come on, dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep either, eh? You remember this tree, don't you? I got my scarf stuck in it all those years ago. There I was, crying like mad, and there you were, running round trying to help me get it down. <laughs> Some things never change, eh? You know, I always imagined we'd spend our whole lives right here in Cobblestone. That's why I was so surprised by what your mum said today. All that stuff about you being the luminary, that reincarnation thing. <sighs> I remember this story my granddad told me. Once upon a time, Long, long ago, the world was terrorised by a horrible monster. But then, the Luminary appeared and saved the day. When it was all over, the Luminary turned into a star. And he's been watching over us from up in the heavens ever since. Yeah. That's I, his I star don't understand right the timeline there. either. I don't get what the hell is happening, but... If the gameplay is good, it's good. How I'm not can you be the luminary it. too? I, I just don't get it. I know. That's what you're going to hear to find out. Legs, 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 legs. I understand, legs, really, I legs, do. Legs, knees, back, thighs. Listen, we should both be getting back. All right, I'm Everyone done. will be wondering done. where we've got to. I'm done. I'm, I'm done. All right. I'm done. I said I was done. No comments. Ah. Goodbye. Old friend. Shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Hey, I, I said I was done with the legs, not the shoulder. <laughs> I'll be right back. I gotta take a bloody piss. Uh, I got a bloody piss, mate. Gotta take a piss. <laughs> well, just look at you. You don't scrub up too bad, you know. Only wish your grandfather were here to see you. You won't forget him, will you? He was a fine, upstanding man, the pride of the village. You could do worse than try to be like him. Well, however you turn out, I'm sure you'll find a way to overcome whatever lies ahead. A mother knows these things. Oh, by the way, I've popped a little money I'd saved for a rainy day in your pack. Don't spend it all at once. 
Why don't you visit the village shop before you head off to Heliodor? You'll need some supplies for your big adventure. But don't take too long. The whole village is turning out to wave you off. Just in time. Uh, I only, I already played the game, so I didn't miss nothing. Wow, time to leave college, stuff. You know, I only been here for less than a minute or a minute or so, but I hate all of them. Turn me out to the world. Who are you? You know how many fucking dangerous monsters there are? No, I'm kidding. But yeah, seriously, I only been here for a minute. I got to know none of you. So once the place burns down, I don't waste money. So once you have God to this point in the game, they start asking you for stuff. Right off the bat. Not one villager that told me to go get this stuff from the roof. I hated that guy, but... He told me... Oh my god! He told me to press... <laughs> oh my lord! Cool, I got gold! Cool, I got a feather! Cool, I got a leg! Can I have my leg back? No. It's mine now. Imagine me for a mom, Eric from South Park, smiling. God. Yeah. So those blue ones mean. Um. West? Those red ones just give you hints of where you need to go. So, always look out for the red ones. This game will not tell you where to go. It will literally give you a middle finger and say, Well, but it's time for you to find out yourself. I would love it if you could tell me. Always gotta say.
Yeah, this is based on a leveling system. So as you get more and more levels, you can have like crap weapons and crap stuff. But uh Yeah, so long as your level's good, it doesn't matter. Um, I might I won't show you that, but just believe me. You gotta trust me on these I have One an day you're just a little boy. The next you're getting, getting ready to leave us. I only wish your grandfather could a see what a fine young man you've become. <laughs> to think, it's been so many years already since old Chalky found you floating in. What do you mean? Since he brought you to Cobblestone. We never thought there was anything out of the ordinary about you. And now suddenly there's all this talk of luminaries of all things. You know who the luminary was, of course. A legendary hero who saved the world from a terrible darkness. And we're supposed to believe that you're him reincarnated? <laughs> I don't doubt old Chalky, of course. But it is a little hard to swallow, I must say. Oh, when you meet the King of Heliodor, put in a good word for old Cobblestone, won't you, eh? <laughs> if he finds out this is the village where the luminary was raised, there might be something in it for us, <laughs> if you catch my drift. Oh, you are terrible. Trust you to be thinking about what you can get out of it. Oh, no, I'm only joking, of course. The very thought. <laughs> anyway, where was I? Ah, yes. Now, the fate that awaits you may well be one beyond anything we simple country folk can imagine. <laughs> But you must allow us to offer what little assistance we can. Take this map of Erdria with you. May it prove useful in finding your way. May this magnificent steed, the pride of Cobblestone, lighten your burden and speed you on your way. You'll find Heliodor easily enough. Just head north out of the village and follow your nose. You travel safely now. Oh, you're such a good boy, such a good boy. You make us proud out there, won't you? And Come back safe. Wait. <sighs> Here, take this with you. I I made it for you. It'll keep you safe. I heard there are lots of monsters where you're going. Be sure to keep it close, won't you? Oh, I don't know what's in store for you out there. But wherever you go and whoever you meet, don't... Don't forget us, will you? Take care. And remember, we'll be waiting for you.
What have we here? I know a budding adventurer when I see one. It can be risky heading into the great outdoors if you aren't familiar with the basics of survival, you know. Well, fear not, because that's where I come in. See the remains of that fire over there? Well, when you spy one of those, it means you can set up camp and rest your weary bones. To settle down for the night, just go up to the fire and examine it. You'll soon be enjoying a well-earned break. What's that? You're worried about being attacked by monsters while you sleep? Oh, ye of little faith! That statue over there is chock full of holy powers that'll keep the beasties at bay for as long as you need. And that's not all. You can pray to it to be cured of poison and all kinds of other things. Think of it as a mini church. Anyway, enough of my yammering. Why don't you take a closer look at all this camping kit for yourself? You'll need to get used to what campsites look like and how to find them. After all, you'll be relying on them whenever you're out in the wilderness. It's like my old dad always said. Keen campers can continue on where others can't. Be prepared. Well, that's all from me. If you have any camping-related queries, feel free to ask. I'm here all the time. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else.
First, state your business. You explain to them uh, da, 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 I'm the luminary, bitch. You better let me in. Or I'm gonna knock you off. <laughs> <laughs> Here, shake my hand, mate. That's the funniest one I've heard all week. Clear off, will ya? We haven't got time for this kind of nonsense. What's that? You want to show that pendant to the king, you say? Uh, uh -huh. Do you mind waiting here a minute? Huh? Ever so sorry for that little misunderstanding. Please, go right on through. His Majesty's waiting for you. Close enough. Welcome to Heliodor Castle, friend. The jewel of Dundrasil. You are bold indeed to have made your way here alone, wanderer. I am Carnelian, ruler of Heliodor. How long have I waited for this day? And now, finally, we meet. Truly, it is an honor. The fact that you come here proffering the jewel and asking to speak with me personally would suggest that you know something of your true nature. I take it that you also bear the mark? Mark of light. Then there is no doubt. You are he. Rejoice, dear subjects. The day is upon us at last. The luminary walks among us once more. <laughs> Tell me, O oh luminary. Where exactly is it that you hail from? I would so very much like to pay tribute to those who took you in and raised you. A town called Cobblestone. If you don't like the name, I'm going to suck my cobblestone. I see. 
cobblestone, you say? Yes. Jasper, you know of this place? I do, my liege. A village of provincial nobodies deep in the rocky south. Then I take it you know what to do. Do not disappoint me. Yes, my liege. <gasps> A cursed luminary. I know not what your intent was in coming here alone, but whatever your wicked scheme, know that it shall not succeed. Take this cur, this harbinger of calamity, and cast him into the furthest corner of the dungeon. Know this, the luminary is the root of all evil and will bring naught but misery to our realm. And why is this? The reason is simple. Just as light is intertwined with darkness, so too is the luminary intertwined with the dread lord of shadows. His coming heralds the resurrection of the Dark One. Did you really think you could fool one as wise as His Majesty? It was your great misfortune to confront one who knows your true nature. Men, seize this wretch! You claim to hail from Cobblestone. Well, before the sun has set three times, we shall know the truth. By then, Jasper will have returned from his investigation. If I were you, Dark Spawn, I would not expect to live beyond that day. Will you keep it down in there? Most folks they throw in here have the decency to wait a while before going stir-crazy. What are you in for, anyhow? You don't get free bed and board down here without having done something pretty bad. Wait, did you save the luminary? You're serious? You're telling me the Luminary has just shown up in the cell next to mine. This is crazy. One plate of delicious gruel for the gentleman in the dungeon suite. Come and get it.
The Luminary. You're serious? So it's all happening just like the Seer said it would. We'd better get out of here. Wait here. You? But... Oh! Don't worry, I didn't kill him. But he won't be waking up anytime soon. Things will get pretty hairy up ahead. You'd better take this. Oh, and I found this in a corner over there. I guess it's your stuff, right? Me? I got this little beauty back, so now I'm pretty much unstoppable. We better get out of here before any more of our tin-headed friends come knocking. Hollow, when you're ready to move out, okay? I spend ages digging this hole, and you just happen to show up the day I finish it? Heck of a coincidence. Guess I really was meant to help you out, just like the seer said. Anyway, there'll be time to talk about all that later. In you go! The sewers, huh? Well, there must be a way out somewhere. Lead the way. I got your back. Ourselves scarce. Damn right. I don't think I'm a proper level to fight these guys. Out of my way. Follow my lead. Follow my lead. Another one bites the dust.
Let's go. Follow my lead. These guys don't give up, do they? Seriously? You okay? Looks like we shook the guards, at least. And that looks like a way out. Maybe our luck's about to change. Oh, if it was only that simple. Why is there a statue down here? Never mind, I'll just save. I can't see Jack down here, man. What's that? And why is it wiggling? And dragging blood. And growling. And why does it have eyes? Wait, there's something there. Stand and fight, we're dead. Oh, Let's yeah. get the heck out of here. Okay. Sorry, I'm not fighting this back. We come back and fight you. Let's get out of here. Doing that. Here goes nothing. We did either way, so we might as well. Whew. I think we gave it the slip. Huh? <laughs> uh, spoke too soon. Quickly! See 
Come on, quickly! Way too close for comfort. What's that thing doing under the castle anyway? Well, whatever. We should get going. Just, I don't know how much more of this I can take. Huh? huh? There he is, the dark spawn. <laughs> ah, me and my big mouth. Move now. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like our luck finally ran out. There they are! We've got them now. <gasps> hmm. No way back, huh? If they catch us, we're dead meat. And will you? <laughs> Hold! <laughs> Let's do this. I believe in you. I believe in the Luminary. I don't have much choice. Come on. Let's not do anything stupid now. The name's Eric, by the way. <laughs>
Alright, I'm ending it here. If you like this, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and always maybe be cool. This got me out of my gaming slump, so. I'm at Cup Lazy Bones. Bye.